everyone and welcome back with another Fortnite video. So today we have the first update of the Fortnite Subject 2 Season 8 and it's going to be a super cool update. We are going to have a lot of uh, Halloween stuff, uh, probably a lot of new skins, a lot of new styles and uh, stick, with, uh, stick with me uh, throughout the entire video because we are going to talk about everything that comes new within this update. So we, from Hypex here we have a new cube town POI with many chests. So there is going to be a new POI added into the game and it's going to be uh, it's going to have a lot of chests as uh, any other cube POI actually uh, this season. Uh, all the cube POIs uh, are having a lot of chests. We are going to have a new Fortnite crew exclusive banner. Uh, new POI there have been many map changes into in the last update so we should expect a lot of changes coming within this update also from also here uh, probably another concept skin uh, is coming into Fortnite we should expect expect this skin into the item shop very very soon uh, we also have the new dual crossbows added into the game probably added into the game super cool item these are going to be duals are going we still don't know the damage and everything but uh, pretty sure we are going to see uh, later on the video as well uh here from uh fire monkey new npc punch cards big mouth green fable knight hair and raven so we have some other npcs and some other punch cards that you yeah, that you can get and complete uh, challenges Uh, we have the glyphic emote which has been updated as well Steamy is having some changes as well. So we also I also heard yesterday that Steamy is going to have some changes We'll see what these changes are later when we get some gameplay Here we have a look at some of the new skins So this is the first one is a concept skin probably from Daja. We have another skin here uh and the renegade the skull trapper uh, skull trapper renegade raider side super cool skins actually we should expect every single skin that we see here into the item shop coming later within these two weeks Also Derby D Dynamo is returning soon. So the new POI is probably going to be called Cube Town. We still don't know the location of this new POI. Here we have the new bundles that are coming within this update. So the first one I think it's the Cube Hunter. I'm not sure about this but uh, I think it's the Cube Hunter and another uh, bundle. Halloween based as I said we should expect a lot of Halloween uh, skins within this update. Here we have old outfits that got an update shop design. So we should expect all these skins that we see here making a return into the item shop. Here we have some new creative devices. Uh, there is going to be another item shop background. Apparently it's going to be the Balenciaga item shop background. It's super cool actually. Here we have here we have the Kevin's pickaxe and the back bling and the Kevin's back bling. Uh, here we have the so the skins are called the Geometric, the Ion, uh, Skaltara and the Cardinal Scream Leader as well. So super cool skins here. We should expect them into the item shop. Uh, a Kevin the cube outfit was added in the last update. So Steamy is showing some major damage this update and see here we can see a few of the buildings in Steamy uh, and they are having a few damages. We still don't know what is causing the damages but we'll see later, uh, probably later on what is causing them. Here we have a few back blinks as well, super cool back blinks actually. So we have the stats for the crossbows or they are called the dual fiend hunters and here we can see I'm going to read only for the gold ones 
so the damage to player is going to be 34, magazine size is going to be 16, fire rate is going to be 4 and the reload time is going to be 2.61 seconds. Super cool actually, we'll see how, I'm really curious to see how this is going to work in game as well. Here we have the gameplay of the emote. So there is a new cube which has been placed near Steamy Starks and this is probably what is causing the damages there as well. And also here is uh, a picture about how is going to look the new Kevin POI, Q, the cube POI. Here we have some uh, new cosmetics that were added within this update. And here from the from JK it appears a new cube has spawned at Steamy Stacks. This cube is the reason for the map changes over at Steamy that uh, we could see into the trailer uh, as well. And here you can see Steamy Stacks and a few changes and a few changes uh, into some of the buildings there. This loading screen will most likely be a reward for crew owners. And here we have another look of the steamy stacks getting a bit destroyed. It's not a, lo a lot, uh, it's not destroyed too much, but it is uh, just a little bit destroyed. And it appears that the cube has been has spawned uh, from, from the pool that was there. If you remember the pool uh, one time was, I think it was at the same, was purple. Uh, probably they were experimenting, maybe, I, this is just my, my conspiracy that they were experimenting there and the cube spawned there that's why that's the reason why the pool was uh, purple at the first place we still don't know that it may be maybe it came down from the sky as the other cubes but uh, that's just uh, that's just a theory that I thought about here is the Balenciaga background for the item shop and here is a video of the cube at Steamy as well So yeah, as I said, it really seems like maybe not, maybe not, maybe I was wrong. So yeah, this is how much steam is destroyed from the cube. So yes, basically this is everything that we have for today's video, there aren't a lot of changes, I mean there are a few changes, that, but there aren't a lot of skins. But uh, the other thing that I saw from Hypex earlier was that we are going to have another update uh, right after this week. So next week we are going to have another update probably, there we are going to have uh, some more uh, Halloween based skins, so don't... Uh, don't be disappointed with uh, with this one update. A few map changes, probably the QPOI is going to be in game as soon as possible. Uh, we are going to make a lot more videos today with streamers reaction to the updates and everything. So stay tuned for that. Thank you for watching. I will be seeing you into the next video. Until then, bye.